So to be completely honest, uh, yesterday was an absolute mess. I did really well on the exercise part. My goal was to be at around 2,000 calories, and I had like 3,000. I was doing actually really well, and then dinner hit, and I just went super overboard. Uh, so I'm pretty frustrated with myself about that, but I'm not gonna let one bad day ruin everything. So what is my plan to solve that? The fact that I went over it by like a thousand. Uh, thought about it, the only logical thing that I can come up with is I was supposed to eat 2,000 calories, I ate 3,000. So today I'm supposed to eat 2,000, I'm gonna eat 1,000. I'm sure some people are gonna advise against that, say that I shouldn't do that, but personally, I believe that part of the reason that I've gotten to where I've gotten is because I haven't been easy on myself. I'm really trying to kind of train that discipline. And personally, I don't think I really learn anything if I don't have consequences to my actions. I believe that every action that's a negative has a consequence. For example, when I was playing football, if we screwed around and didn't really focus during practice, we'd have to run hills. Our action was we chose to screw around and not take practice seriously. And then the consequence was that we'd have to run extra. I mean, that was youth football. And I feel like that was something that like, kind of taught a little bit of like discipline in me. Let's say you're an athlete and you have a great game. The next day you're probably gonna wake up feeling pretty good, probably still riding that high and you're probably gonna have another good day. To me, I don't really care about that. For example, if I'm watching LeBron play basketball, I don't really care to see how he reacts or how he feels or how he plays the next game after a game where he had a 40 point triple double and they beat the LA Clippers on national television. On the flip side, what I am very interested in seeing is how LeBron is gonna react if he had a game where he shot four for 18 from the field and he lost by double digits to the freaking Pistons. So when I look at what I did yesterday and how I messed up and I did things I shouldn't have done and I was undisciplined and I was lazy, I look at it and I just realize that I have to do better starting today. And I think that that is what builds character because again, anybody can have a great day and follow it up with another great day. Because I mean, you have that momentum and like it's, it's really when you get punched in the face and even though it was my fault, I pretty much punched myself in the face. But being able to get up and just really realize like, yep, mess that one up, but not let it set the tone for the rest of the week. I'm not trying to come off as a jerk, but what I am trying to do is just be genuine because uh, again, I have lost over 100 pounds and I'm definitely still not perfect, but I have kind of learned that being too nice to myself has never benefited me. I'm gonna do a weight loss vlog today and I'm going to show how I, I guess, like bounce back. So yeah, that'll be up tomorrow and I'll see you tomorrow.